Yeah. Yeah. I remember when you guys introduced me to this. <laughs> it's, uh... I'm gonna be doing some grinding when this thing goes live. Bro. Like, right now, because it's PTU, like, I don't really care about what I do. But when I, uh, when this thing goes live, sure, man. I'm gonna be grinding for real. Got him, let's go. Woo! That's so much fun. And then, uh, my buddies right now, they're, they're in Elite Dangerous. They're trying to get me over, but I can't do it, man. Star Citizen has my heart. Bro, yeah, Elite, I... there's a great migration happening right now. <laughs> All the elite dangerous players are coming to Star Citizen right now. I've it's tried crazy. All. I've tried elite. I've tried Eve. I've tried everything. I just have never enjoyed it as much as Star Citizen and Wing right? Commander and yeah, uh, Freelancer. Yeah. Um, you I got think a question I'm... in the. Uh, Oh, I see that. I see that. Um, got a question. Uh, what's your thought on the potential of a player space piracy mechanic in the future? Oh, good question. Um, the way I'm seeing it right now, right? With Star Citizen um, moving us with CIG soon to implement new systems. Pyro is going to be a pirate heavy system in terms of NPCs as well as real players when orgs actually is fully implemented into the game and base building is going to be in the game it's going to be a very important thing especially with um, physical inventory coming into the game so looting um, physical inventory so is going to be looting is going to be coming in in P15 actually in this game? yeah so you kill somebody you can take whatever they have their backpacks their whatever is attached oh to my yeah it's gonna be a completely my different mining game modules yeah don't <laughs> take my, my mining modules yeah. hey i'll tell you right now when you be thinking about overloading your, your titan and you be like my mind telling me no <laughs> <laughs> yeah yeah you, you have to think about everything but my you aim my aim telling me yes <laughs> telling you man Telling My you. level four arbitrations don't want to hurt nobody. <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna but be a different game. But if you lock on me, <laughs> I'm telling you, it, I'm right? gonna lose your body. <laughs> <laughs> Gaming Mog Y 1993. Thank you for the follow. I appreciate it, man. But yeah, piracy is gonna be a big thing. It's gonna be big. It's gonna be big for real. Um, I think they there's a lot of right now piracy is is very limited in terms of gameplay like it's just drug trading and you only have access to grim hex really as a pirate location as opposed to everywhere else when you're civil right so in the future the biggest pirate locations is going to be the next system pyro um there's going to be very pirate heavy locations and and i think there's gonna be a lot of valuable resources over there as well so those that are civil that also want to go there for the really cool um loot or whatever that's over there it's gonna be really interesting in terms of um trying to avoid the pirates all the traps that's gonna be setting like the quantum snares while you're jumping you gotta be you gotta be wary about the trajectory you're jumping because they may anticipate where you're gonna be jumping from so you're gonna have to think about all those things when you're in a pyro system and, and things like that so it's gonna it's gonna be interesting man i'm looking forward to it can't wait yeah so any idea when 3.14 is coming out i know it's, it's soon it's but i don't supposed, know when. it's supposed to be it's supposed to be out already but they're saying that by this week it should be out i'm not sure yeah, back i think in, i think at, at the end of june they said it was going to be sometime in july but july has come and gone yeah i don't know but what, what, making, what the issue is a lot of testing going on a lot of testing yeah and they're tweaking it they're tweaking and making tweaks to it so it's yeah. gonna be awesome when it comes out yeah. i'm really i'm really wait. i'm really looking forward to the 215 though man with the, the medical medical gameplay man i'm really looking forward to that 
Yeah, that's where when you basically when you die, you're gonna have to repair yourself in the hospital. Yes, 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 yes. That's yes. Interesting. It's gonna be really fun. It's gonna be really fun. What the heck? So it looks like with medical gameplay, there is so there's gonna be a medic as a career. And I think there's also gonna be doctors, like player doctors, literally gonna be at the hospital. Because remember a few patches ago they introduced trolleys. Right. Now I'm realizing when you go into the hospitals right now, there are trolleys, but like their medical devices are on them. They're like medical trolleys. And I feel like those that was why they were they put in trolleys in 312 and 313 they wanted to test it yeah. for the upcoming medical gameplay so if they're introducing trolleys that means players are going to be at the hospitals with like fixing people up that's interesting that's going to be crazy i'm telling you they're yeah. planning on with this gameplay loop i don't know if doctors so you are going to be actually have a career as like a doctor that's what i'm thinking that's oh, what yeah, I'm wow. thinking. That's the way I was looking when I was looking at it to you. That's what I'm thinking. Man. That's amazing. They're gonna, they're, pff, bro. What they're planning is, it's gonna be crazy, man. If if what I'm thinking is right, oh man, they're gonna take the industry, bro. They're gonna take the industry. It's gonna be interesting, man. Yeah, but my buddies are like hooked on freaking Elite Dangerous right now. Yeah, they're, they're going to come. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. <laughs> They'll be here. They'll be here. They were here. Matter they of fact, were? one of them spent 300 bucks on ships. He just oh, okay. got frustrated because of bugs is what he told. Oh, okay. Oh, don't worry. He'll be back. He'll be back. He came in for he said that he was. He can't deny it. He said that Star Citizen is way probably the number one space game in general when it fully comes out but right now he just said the bugs are irritating him yeah i i think he's he's, he's used to this, the the stability of elite dangerous being a complete game so you know this this so is again? an alpha so i think he's just used to um elite dangerous being a fully complete game while this is an yeah. alpha you know what i mean so i get it some people feel that way too a lot of players don't play stars because they want it to be Re fully released you know before they they touch it um you're right what's going on how you doing yo what's uh the best 300 um what's the best 300 pilots is in what's good oh you're the best you're the best 300 pilots really we're gonna have to see about that <laughs> um that's cool um i know i'll be out uh they're committing piracy <laughs> now we know <laughs> but yeah i think piracy is going to be interesting um for real man it's going to be interesting Does right anybody now it's... know i turn the head cam off when you're like moving in your ship and stuff when you're dog fighting the hay cam off what do you mean so when you're flying around your head movement in the ship moves is there any way to put it to fix Oh, um, oh, give me a second. Let me, I think I know what you're talking about. There's, there's an option in the, um, the same area where you set up. You can the find the key to turn it on and off. I think, it. I think, um, you know, the numpad, the slash, the forward slash on the numpad, hit that and try it. Yeah. I have a key bound to toggle it on and off. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's still not. I don't think that's it. Then it, it must be yeah, in the options, it. though. Yeah. It's in the there options. There should be a toggle bind. Um, real quick. So I think, like, so it it moves when you're in third person. You said? No, 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 no. In my ship flying around in a dogfight, the camera shifts towards like. Sometimes I will shift down towards my dash. Yeah. If, like it messes with my fuel a little bit. Oh. I was watching that uh, video where you can actually turn it off. Oh, that I don't know. I think they automatically have that in. Um, 
Okay. I'm not sure where where. No, maybe sure. under gameplay settings, maybe. If you check under gameplay settings. Because they, they automatically have the player character doing that. Oh my gosh. I, oh, there it is. All right, so no med pen. There's the NPCs inside. Um, tell R. Kelly to calm down. <laughs> In a box <boxing. laughs> Oh, you're killing me, man. Um, you know your piracy. Um, you know uh, piracy is and will be the hardest game pool uh in a game right it is gonna be it is gonna be i believe so but it's gonna be rewarding though even though it's gonna be it's gonna be high risk high reward type of thing uh piracy gameplay exists now mostly ransom robbing robbing miners and taking down haulers the ransom yeah yeah and taking their cargo but trading isn't worth much lately so mostly miners are the targets few orgs post their game yeah um i've seen that what hey, is in the box and call me R. Kelly? Tell him thank you, man. <laughs> Jeez, I'm trying to get paid. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, but tell man. him he needs to convince my wife to get the <laughs> Toby. The Toby? <laughs> oh, man. Uriah says it's in game settings. So check game set game game settings. Should, should be there. Yes. Just show her how much cheaper the Toby is than a full VR set. Yeah, but I want yeah. now. I'm thinking about doing running dual joysticks and upgrading. So it's either one or the other. <laughs> mm. I don't know. You're gonna have to do a lot of convincing, man. A lot. <laughs> <laughs> As Jim Carrey say, I like it a lot. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I can't get rid of this Titan, man. It's so much fun flying this thing. Yeah, I mean, it was a good choice, man. Anyway, I'm gonna tell you. Anyway, I'm gonna tell you. I know there's some more in here. Just don't get it. kind of like these uh these cargo retrieval missions you get a get a chance to do some fps but uh, the npcs yeah, like they, they need they need to work on the npcs for real though they're not challenging at all they just stand there clear so um resin have you completed these missions this this specific one that i'm doing right now where it's a free it's a it's a, um what, what's with the miss all the people yeah inside and retrieve the cargo and it's time it's a it's a time um there's some timing restrictions once you take them out of the uh, these uh, containers because they're, they're volatile, right? Oh yeah, the volatile cargo, right? Yeah. Yeah. So. Yeah, I've done that. I've done that once. Yes. How did you complete it? Because I feel like I always run out of time before I can get the timer starts from when you I think when you extract it yeah you just have to make sure that you you know you you're ready when you're ready to extract them extract them all mm -hmm. make sure everything is clear before you extract them right but it's the ones I, I like the ones that you pull out of a freelancer crash because the ones from a 
uh, what is this, a Starfarer. Yeah. This, these are tough to find, and sometimes they're actually glitched where you actually can't get them. Yeah, I think that's, that's the issue I ran into last. Like, sometimes they're just inaccessible because they just randomly spawn in a bad spot. Okay, so it's not just me. Okay. Yeah. The ones that are that you go get them out of a freelancer crash those are a lot easier because it's just like the yeah, star fair is like a maze man there's like yeah, it is. Yeah, panels yeah. there's like yeah if you you could jump up there's like a compartment up there yeah, yeah. that's wow. it's 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 like a maze man. it is okay so i think i have, I have my bearings i think i know where they are let's do this Thirty minutes. Oh my goodness, that's good. Tank. Is this outside? Oh, no, yeah. It's the not. minute you pick it up, I think that's when it starts. The timer starts ticking. Yeah. But now I I know exactly where they all are. So this this is the first time I've actually found all of them. So. Let's, let's see how this goes. I should have even brought the MSR closer. This is really good if you run with the crew. So that more, yeah, right. more ants. I've never actually completed a Starfarer one. I've only done the Freelancer ones. Right, okay. But if you have a fast ship, it should yeah. be doable. So with, with with this one, I think Zeta Prolane. Zeta Prolanide. Um, can I jump with it? I don't think you can. Oh no. Uh, well, so. actually, I'm not sure. It depends on your destination. Is your destination on the same planet? I'll have to see. So, so quickly get the type of like ten minutes left. I know there's some delivery missions that you can't, you can't jump. Yeah, in. yeah. I'm just not sure which one this is. I'm pretty sure that one you can jump. You can jump with that one. Yeah. Whoa! <laughs> watch, watch me jump and I just blow up. That'd be <laughs> hilarious. <laughs> it should tell you in the mission. Yeah. In the mission description. Yeah. Check it before. Where is it? All right. Let's just be out of here. So, uh, what kind of um, career are you planning to get into, uh, Resin, once this thing goes live? For me? Yeah. Um, I joined the the uh, United Mining Corporation. Oh, nice. Okay. For so right now, mining is my thing. I just love, you know, chilling mm. and mining. It's just right. Like zen, you know. It is. It is. It is. But I I'm on all rounder. Like I like. PVPing, I like dog fighting, I like mm -hmm. I like to try a little bit of everything. Okay. But if you're talking a career, I think mining is probably so the only yes. thing right now that I'm really would commit to. Okay. Cool. Yeah, me too. I, I really enjoy mining. It's it's a nice um it's 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 a good thing to do once you're not trying to be in into combat. Because it's not all the time you want to do combat, right? What the hell? Right. You know, so... And, uh, it's, mm -hmm. it's cool because I joined the United Mining Corporation and they have like a Discord server where they help you out and they, mm -hmm. they'll they actually escort you on mining oh, runs. Yeah. Oh, that's cool. Just to protect you from pirates. It's really nice. cool. The, the, nice. Like, you do get benefits from, from joining... You know? Yeah. Nice, 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 nice. And they have all kinds of like achievements and badges you can get. It's pretty, pretty cool. Oh, that's cool. Mm. 
Yeah, for like, me, I I've... once found, mm -hmm. I once found like a nine rock quant deposit that had like nine rocks? six rocks that were like fifty quant or more. Are you serious? And I posted a screenshot of it. Everyone's like, "Holy cow!" <laughs> <did you find laughs> that? Bro, I've never heard of that. <laughs> yeah, it was insane. It was on Lyria. It was like uh Lyria, it was like okay. nine rock deposit, nine rocks all near each other. And oh. like maybe not six, maybe like three or four of them were like fifty plus quant. That and I was crazy. so pissed I was in a prospector, I couldn't do I couldn't <laughs> get all, all I got them. was three uh you know, thirty SCUs of quant. SC, yeah. That if hurts, I was bro. in a mole, I could have gotten so much more, you know. Oh yeah, you could have walked away with like I think one point two million. A million UAC, yeah, just like that. Yes. Ooh, <laughs> that's a ship. Yeah. Damn. Oh man, that's unfortunate. It sucks when that happens, though. It's always it's always when you 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 take out the prospector, you know. Right. I did the most I ever got out of a solo mole mission was mm. uh, 56, so, 56 quant. I have a question for you 56 guys. Quant. Okay. Would you recommend a logging out in my ship or logging out at a docking station dock. like Hurston? Dock. Okay. You, you don't, you don't want to end up. Dock. Yeah, you don't want to end up in an infinite loading screen where it can't find where your ship is and it just doesn't it's just load too you. risky. Yeah. It's I think that's what caused it originally. That might have been what caused my glitch. Yep, that's probably it. It really sucks so I've when you can't log out before and then I've I've I couldn't get back into the game and I I did the character gender change and that fixed it. I was oh, able really? to get back in. Oh, and then nice. another time it happened to me and they said they said launch your ship in arena commander or not arena the hangar mm. and i did that and that worked oh that's without cool without having a character reset so there's workarounds but it's just at this point i just avoid it completely it's just yeah. not worth the risk it is it is a cool idea hopefully they, they It'll figure be it awesome out awesome if they get it to work right yeah, yeah. Right now, it just sucks. I did I've... actually. the The coolest thing that actually worked once is I was mining on Lyria in mm. uh, in a mole, mm. and while mining, I thirty k'd. Mm. What does thirty k mean? Thirty k means your game crashes and you're instantly out. You're disconnected from the server. It's like an instant game crash. The server, mm. basically, the server crashes, and everyone yeah. on the server gets logged out. Yeah. And usually, what when that happens, you respawn as if you like had just died. You respawn at wherever the last place you docked was. Yeah. But this one time, I 30k'd, and when I logged back in the next day, I was in the same exact spot on the planet. Oh yeah. It was like I had never it was it was nighttime. The the time of day had changed, but I was mm. in the same exact position right over the rocks on Lyria. Mm. And it blew me away when that happened. <laughs> you, you know so, what? Like that's what persistent when it, when they get persistence to work, that's yeah. what it's going to be like. It's like if you disconnect or if you anything, you're still in the universe. Yeah. In the spot that you were. Yeah. I think they're testing that in the background, but they haven't really announced it to us. I think. I think that's what it is. I think they are. They're experimenting with it. Yeah, because yeah. that's the, like one of the biggest challenges they're working on right now. Right. right. Mm. What kind of players are you? Casual or hardcore? I would say I'm casual. Uh, sketch, what's going on? Sketch therapy, what's going on? Oh, he said it happened to him too. 
I'm, I, it happens to a lot, man. It, it, it happened to me at one point. It was very frustrating not being able to get in. It really sucked, man. Not a lot, but a couple of times. But bed logging doesn't work in PTU. I don't even bother trying. I don't want to bug my character. I don't even bother trying anymore. So I get, I, I can jump with this. Um, oh, this is going to Rio. What does work pretty well that I like is uh, you can, uh, if you do PV, if you, uh, FPS missions. Yeah. You can take a Cutlass Red. Yeah. And you can have set your spawn point in one of the beds so if you die in the mission you can respawn in your ship yeah yeah that's really and that works pretty well yeah 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 i i usually do that with my carrick and sometimes when we do multiple a couple of yep. guys have a red a carrick has red. an icu also yeah yeah very useful especially when you want to do like events and stuff like that it's uh, really nice it's so dark, I can't see anything. Please don't let me snap into the door. this game looks bad. <laughs> it is. It's beautiful, man. Every time you log in, it reminds you that you're playing Star Citizen. <laughs> Just in case you forget, you know? Okay, there it is. I can hardly see that thing's a sandstorm here. Oh, shoot. What are these rocks? Oh, this is the junkyard. Are you on Daymar? Yeah. Oh, okay. Brought me all the way to Daymar. And I'm running out of time. Let me, let me just land real quick before. Oh my goodness. What's I that? can't believe that worked. What did you do? I don't even care. My vehicle's gonna get impounded. It's good. Yeah, a lot of people park their ships in an impound spot just so they don't have to so they get instant teleported into the yeah station oh uh, no my ramp I gotta hurry I think I'm short on time I think at least I probably have like one minute left one of them Yeah, I usually run those missions in the Titan because it's like easy in and out of the ship, you know? Yeah, <laughs> I have to go through so many doors. It's ridiculous. No elevators involved. <laughs> oh, it's red. It's red. It's red. 27 seconds. 27 seconds. Oh, no, uh... it's gonna blow up in your face. <laughs> 22 seconds. <laughs> what? No! 59 meters away. Ah, uh, it's gonna kill me, though. Uh, 13 seconds. Where is it? Run. Oh, I'm run. not gonna make it. I'm not gonna make it, bro. I gotta drop it. Run! Ah! <laughs> uh... <laughs> Yo, it literally Did blew it up. Blow up. It blew up. It's gonna blow my ship. <laughs> <Damn. Oops. laughs> Alright, this one has, has a minute. This one's good. Bro, this. Yo, no, you have, you have to roll with a crew with this. You gotta, you gotta take this with a crew. Uh, oh, I still have the rest. I, I, I still can deliver the rest, I think. Wow. Just imagine mid-flight, <laughs> you see an explosion. <laughs> oh, yeah. Back of your ship is on fire. 
Oh man, that's hilarious. yeah. They're gonna. I heard that they're gonna have that. They're gonna have ship fires eventually. Yeah. Oh man, it you looked amazing. Like, you have to put out fires in your ship. That's gonna. It be looked awesome. amazing, man. Wow. It like they don't have to do that, but they're doing it. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like that's oh, yeah. crazy. They're, they're going places that no other game would ever dare it's go. It's crazy, man. It's like they're trying to make sure that nobody could even compete for the next 20 yeah. years. <laughs> yep, pretty much. Oh my goodness. I'm glad they're doing it. How many more years do you think it's going to be before it's actually complete? That's a good question. Yo, that's a really good question. I don't think it, there's ever going to be a point where it's like, okay, it's done. I think it'll just keep yeah. evolving and get more game loops. Yeah fixed bugs yeah and it'll just evolve more star systems and then at some point yeah. people will be like okay so is this released you know it's just gonna keep evolving like that um, so do you think it's ever gonna release or you think it's gonna stay in this state i think at some point they'll have some like when it's ready for mm. mass consumption they'll do some kind of promotion where they'll right you know mm. they'll do some kind of launch type event i think yeah. yeah yeah i think i think um like you like you said it, it it will continuously they'll continuously develop it but when they feel like they've had a decent amount of gameplay loops then they'll decide and enough star systems that they're satisfied with yeah, then they'll exactly. say you know what we're gonna make this star citizen 1.0 and then yeah, there's gonna be a big launch event yeah yeah and then they'll still add new ships they'll still add um new systems new gameplay loops and, and things of that nature yeah they'll continue adding stuff and it you yeah know. yeah I so mean, that's uh, how all modern games are right they're all right. like they're all continuously developed from right. alpha all the way into you know Right, 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 right. The marker's still there, though. But yeah, man, I think it will take, um, I would say the next three years 